Hey there, so are you having troubles finding buyers? You know, finding those leads that are willing to pay for what you have? If so, you're going to enjoy this next presentation I have just for you coming up. Hey everybody, this is Eddie Sand, and today I decided to do a presentation for you. You know, I've I've done this report and I'm going to go ahead and show it to you because I believe you've seen this before, but uh, it bears repeating that it's something that you can download absolutely free. And I'm going to show you what's inside, okay? That's what the presentation is all about today. I'm going to show you how are the three strategies that I have found and I have put into this report, how are they going to help you find your leads the ones that are willing to buy what you have so that you can have better sales this year, right? More sales, close more sales, grow your online business and become one of the top affiliate marketers in your industry. So let me show you what I'm talking about right now. All right. So what do you do to find buyers? Well, first of all, I believe, and you guys can agree with me by giving me, giving me a like or typing yes, I believe that most affiliate marketers are looking for more leads, good leads, are looking to increase their sales, and they are basically ultimately want to build a passive income. Isn't that right? You know, give me a like, say yes, because if so, then this is going to be for you. Now, there is a problem. The problem is that most of you, if you're struggling to get leads and make more sales, is because you have a block. You you feel that you just don't know enough and you find yourself always going after learning something else, something new, but never really seeing the return on the investment that you put in the time and effort and sometimes money. It's not that you don't know enough but it's that you know too much. And by you being overwhelmed with information, you are blocking your potential. It's not so much about learning and learning and learning. It's about doing and doing and doing. And the way you do is whatever you're passionate about, whatever topic you're into your business, learn it, practice it, and teach it. That is something very important that I always teach in my groups. My goal here today is to basically help you take action. You know, it really comes down to very simple strategies that I'm going to show you today to make sure that you get what you want. Now, who is this training for? Well, if you're using affiliate marketing to build a passive income, but you're not finding good leads that are willing to buy from you and you're feeling stressful because you're not getting in any any return on your time and money invested. So let's get to it. The three essential strategies that I have for you today are really going to help you find good leads willing to buy from you. But I'm going to shock you here in a moment because you will see that this is something that most affiliate programs are not teaching enough. The number one thing is market research. There is some market research involved in this. This is a real business. Yes, it's online business. Yes, it's affiliate marketing. Yes, you're selling other people's products. But uh, yeah, you need the research. And oh my goodness, when I found this, first I was scared because I'm thinking, oh no, I've got to do all this extra work now. And But you know what? When I did, things just came to place. So my question for you is this. What? Who's your niche? Who's your niche? You know, I had a couple of conversations uh, throughout the weekend in, in my group. And one of the questions that I have for them was, where are you having the most problem or difficulty in your online business? And I will tell you that very often, I came down by answering their their problem. I broke it down into the niche. They did not have a very clear, specific niche market. I'll give you an example. There was someone who is looking to uh, basically help other 
um, network marketers out there. And, and, and she's looking to basically help them out by giving them the, the information they need to use online marketing. But here's the catch. When you go and search for network marketing, this, that is one of the biggest and humongous market there is. And it's so, so difficult to find a good niche within there. Reason why is because, you know, direct selling industry is pretty good. It's been very, very, very successful. And there are leaderships, there are training, and most people, it's like a, it's like a cult. <laughs> That's the best thing I can tell you. It's like a cult. Most people are not going to go anywhere else but follow their lead. All right. So for you, for anyone to get into this market, you need to know your niche. You need to have a very specific niche. And how do you find that is by using keywords, right? Start with that first. Uh, look to see what are the low hanging fruit keywords out there to see that. How is it that you can actually solve somebody's problem within the network marketing or any market that you are going after? Um, again, as an affiliate marketer, you will never run out of things to sell, all right? Because you can be affiliated with multiple companies and always have a solution for someone. But you know what's gonna take your business, your online business to a higher level? It's gonna be when you provide to that specific niche your brand, when you start providing that, then that's when success happens for you. So again, who's your niche? Okay, you've got to, you, if you're affiliated with any company right now, the, the other way to do it is for you to look at the company that you're affiliated with and see who's their market and then ask yourself the question, who within that market can I go and help? What small group is asking for what specific thing? The second thing that you need to have is you need to have a business plan. Yep. It's, you have, you have to have a business plan. This is not, get rich quick type of thing that you think by you joining a program or by you starting to promote a business or a, or a product or a service that you're going to start making hundreds and thousands of dollars each month. It's not going to happen unless you have a very clear path on what you need to do. So my question to you is, what's your angle? What's your angle? How are you going to approach this? What's your plan? Okay, so there are usually three things that you can do to enter into that niche market, and that is to be a reviewer. Uh, one of the things that I like about YouTube uh, videos is that I always go there to find out how to do something and how to learn about something. And so there's a lot of reviewers, people who actually get what I'm looking for. They test it out. You know, they, they use it. They give me their honest review. And that helps me make a better decision when, whether to go after something and to get it or not. So as a reviewer, you can be that type of person. Why don't you then become a reviewer by actually getting the products you sell and reviewing them, right? You do it. You go after it. Help someone to make a better choice. And you know what? People are going to start liking and trusting you. So they're going to click on whatever link you have. And of course, they'll get it, right? Or they'll come back for more. But you can become one of those reviewers. You can do it on, on Facebook, but very likely you're going to use YouTube for that. Uh, the go-to person. Okay, this is one that I, I personally like. And this is something that I train my group because I, I let them know that branding is very important. You know, affiliate marketing, it's a huge opportunity for anyone. It's always been there. As a matter of fact, if you don't know any history about affiliate marketing, this all started back when Amazon started doing this. They are the ones who started doing the affiliate marketing before uh, before all these companies right now. So this was way back in the 90s. But why is this a huge opportunity? Because I don't think it's going anywhere. You know, companies are out there. They're willing to pay for billions of dollars for advertising to for people to go buy their products and services. Let me tell you, they will pay you good money for you to affiliate with them and promote their products. So when you become your own brand, when you brand yourself as the go-to person in that industry, whatever industry you're in, there's no limit to what you can do, really. You know, you can use what you're good at and then be able to help others and, again, 
uh, be compensated very well. Now, the social personality. Okay. Um, if you know live TV, uh, I, I, I guess they still have them, but I remember they used to have live TVs where they follow like the superstars or something like that. They go to their home and, and you know, you're looking at their lifestyle behind, uh, the scenes kind of thing, right? A social personality is something like that. Okay. You become a personality to the eyes of the social media world. Really fun to do if you have that type of personality. But again, I'm giving you this three ways and this is not it. I'm just giving you three to get your brain to start thinking, what's your angle? You know, are you going to review things? Are you going to become the expert, a specific thing, the go-to person at a specific um, uh, area? Or are you going to be like a social personality behind the scenes, living your life and, and basically showing people how they can live their lives like yours as well? All right, so the final thing is marketing. Marketing is obviously very important. Marketing is always ever-changing, okay? And because of your niche market, you're going to know how to market to them. So marketing is a very strategic part of your entire plan. And the question that I have for you is this. What's your traffic source? What's your web traffic source? Because when you mark, when you're marketing your business, your industry, your brand, your product services, where are you getting this traffic source for, from? All right. So I'll give you some ideas as well. So for example, many of us go social media. Uh, again, I think that is definitely a great platform, but you got to learn how to use it. You can't just go there and start posting stuff that, you know, people will repel once you, it's almost like spamming, right? You start spamming everything in social media and just people will not like you. You can do SEO. Now, SEO, I will tell you, it's all about keywords. That does take time. If you're familiar with it and if you understand it, then go for it. I think uh, writing, still writing some articles with good SEO will actually get you into a good place in Google search, but also give you access to get some traffic, okay? And paid advertising, okay? So paid advertising, that kind of says it all. And, and another question that I have for you is this. Which one of those three would you pick? If you answer just one of those three, I want you to consider using them all. What you want to do, though, is you want to master one at a time. Do not start with all three at the same time. In my recommendation, paid advertising is it. Start with that first. Or if you started before with something else and it hasn't worked, go to paid advertising. It is the most effective and efficient way for you to find out more about your demographics and psychographics of your market. It will totally transform your business. And that's what I have for you today. That's that's basically all the details are, are found here inside the report that I have, Finding Your Buyers. You can obviously download this at no cost. It's absolutely free. EddieSand.com slash skills. Go ahead and download it. Read all the details that I have for you. And let me come back to you now. And I really hope you enjoy this information. If you found it helpful, give me a like, share this video, and subscribe, okay? Because I will continue to give you good quality information to help you get the leads that you need so that you can close more sales and be more productive in this coming year, 2019. So until next time, talk to you later. Peace. Subscribe, like, subscribe, do all that cool stuff here. I appreciate that.